Yo, it's Dr. Cool Auto Fix. In the heart of Zimbabwe, a revolution is brewing. A revolution fueled not by conflict or greed, but by the boundless potential of human ingenuity. At the forefront of this revolution stands Maxwell Chikambutso, a name whispered in hushed tones, a beacon of hope in a world grappling with energy crises and environmental devastation. Chikumbutso is not a politician or a tycoon. He is an inventor, a visionary who dares to dream of a future free from the shackles of fossil fuels and centralized power. His invention, the Scythe Kaivi, is not just another electric vehicle, it is a paradigm shift, a bold declaration that challenges the very foundations of our energy systems. Imagine a world where cars run not on gasoline or even lithium-ion batteries, but on a self-charging system that draws energy from the environment itself. This is the promise of the Sayeth Kaivi, a promise that has sent ripples of excitement and trepidation across the globe. The world watches with bated breath, waiting to see if Chikumbutso's creation will live up to its extraordinary claims. If it does, the Sayeth Kaivi has the potential to rewrite the rules of the game, ushering in an era of clean, sustainable energy for all. But the path of innovation is rarely smooth. Chikumbutso's journey is a testament to the challenges, the risks, and the unwavering determination required to bring a world-changing invention to life. The heart of the Scythe Kaivi lies in its revolutionary energy system. Chikumbutso remains tight-lipped about the specifics, citing concerns of intellectual property theft. However, what we do know is this. The Saith Kaivi does not need to be plugged in, nor does it rely on traditional batteries. Instead, it is said to utilize a proprietary technology that harnesses energy from the environment, effectively creating a self-charging system. Skepticism is understandable. The laws of physics, as we understand them, dictate that energy cannot be created from nothing. Yet, throughout history, countless innovations were initially met with disbelief, only to later reshape our understanding of the world. Could the Sayeth Kaivi be tapping into a source of energy we have yet to fully comprehend? Is it possible that Chikumbutso has unlocked a secret that has eluded scientists and engineers for centuries? These are the questions that fuel the imagination and ignite the debate surrounding this groundbreaking invention. The answers, once revealed, have the potential to redefine our relationship with energy and propel us into a new era of technological advancement. A Maxwell Chikumbutso is no stranger to adversity. His path to the Scythe Kaivi is paved with years of tireless research, unwavering dedication and a steadfast belief in his vision. His journey began long before the Scythe Kaivi with the development of an infinite energy battery prototype. This groundbreaking technology, capable of powering devices indefinitely without needing recharging, thrust Chikumbutso into the spotlight. However, his newfound fame came at a price. In 2017, tragedy struck. Chikumbutso was poisoned under mysterious circumstances, an event that many believe was a deliberate attempt to silence him and suppress his revolutionary work. The incident, while terrifying, only strengthened his resolve. It served as a stark reminder of the forces that often stand in opposition to true innovation, particularly when it threatens to disrupt established power structures and challenge the status quo. Undeterred, Chikumbutso recovered and continued his research in secrecy, driven by the conviction that his work could change the world for the better. The Saith Kaivi stands as a testament to his resilience, a symbol of his unwavering commitment to a brighter future. Chikumbutso's story is not unique. History is replete with examples of groundbreaking inventions and visionary thinkers who faced opposition, ridicule and even threats to their lives. Muammar Gaddafi's ambitious project to create a self-sufficient water supply for Libya through a network of underground aquifers known as the Great Man-Made River was met with skepticism and ultimately destroyed in the 2011 NATO intervention. Stanley Meyer, the inventor of a water-powered car, died under suspicious circumstances after refusing to sell his patent and technology to powerful oil companies. Even further back, the thriving Black Wall Street community in Tulsa, Oklahoma, a testament to black entrepreneurship and economic empowerment, was brutally attacked and destroyed in 1921. These examples, though diverse in nature, share a common thread. 
They represent threats to established power structures and challenge the dominance of those who control resources and wealth. They serve as stark reminders that progress is not always linear and that the pursuit of knowledge and innovation can come at a great personal cost. In the late 1990s, making a radio transmitter, digital navigator, turbine engine using scrap metal. And in 2009, he began his journey into green energy. Hear him explain it to the president, Comrade Emerson Dabuz of Nagagua at State House. No fuel, nothing. Nothing, no fuel. First in the world. The first in the world. This is power from the sky. Yeah, from the radio frequency. This one you have in Zimbabwe. Yes, we have done it in Zimbabwe. Can you explain? Yeah. So the vehicle it is powered with what we call a microsonic energy device. That is the after <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the vehicle, it uses what we call the microsonic energy device. The microsonic energy device, it is the, the device that I personally invented in 2009, which harnesses radio frequencies, converted it into energy. As you know, radio frequencies, they are measured in nano volts, meaning to say they are less than a volt, they are just in, like nothing, but we find a way of harnessing it through the 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 creation of uh, the seventy percent of the components in the microsonic energy, which I tell me to have designed. So those are the components that 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 enable uh, the radio frequency to be transferred into pure useful energy. And this is the first time in the world. So they wanted to arrest him for changing physics. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. Even when we tried to file a patent, they said we were violating the natural laws of physics. Mm. So it's not an industrial applicable. We decided to take the trade secret route after that. So with this car, you can also use it to power your house. It is a moving generator. When you drive from work uh, back to your home, you can connect your power cable, then you can power your house. It, is, it gives you 15 kilowatts uh, power to power your house. Top speed is 220 kilometers per hour. Yeah, which is fast. It has got two driving modes. We have got the sport mode, which will give you zero to 100 kilometers per hour in around two seconds. Chukumbuzo also talks about his journey to Silicon Valley in the United States of America, where he was poisoned together with his partner, who passed on for defying the laws of physics. We were poisoned at that time. Dr. Teddy didn't make it. He died in January 2017. I survived by the grace of God. Uh, so I was always in Zimbabwe and United States of America until he heard about myself. Then he invited me. The president. He, the president, yes. Then he invited me to, 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 to come back and put my base in Zimbabwe. So right now I'm based in Zimbabwe. President Munangagwa says he called him back home to do his work here in Zimbabwe and is happy to grace the occasion when the vehicles are launched. Is there any other vehicle in the world? Uh, with this technology, you know, this is the first vehicle in the world. Where is it? Here yeah, in Zimbabwe. This is my only vehicle. It's about in three million. Stay there. I said, let them eat their three million. <laughs> Come here, we eat something. Section 5 The Potential Dawn, a world powered by Syeth Kaivi. Let us for a moment imagine a world where the Syeth Kaivi's promise becomes reality. Picture a world where the noxious fumes of exhaust pipes are replaced by the gentle hum of self-charging vehicles, where the reliance on dwindling fossil fuels becomes a relic of the past. Imagine the transformative impact on our environment, our economies, and our very way of life. The implications are staggering. Developing nations long shackled by energy poverty could finally access a clean and sustainable source of power, fueling economic growth and improving living standards. Mega cities choked by smog and pollution could breathe a collective sigh of relief as the air clears and the threat of climate change begins to recede. The very fabric of our societies could be reshaped as the centralized power grids that currently dictate our lives become increasingly irrelevant. Individuals and communities could become energy independent, generating their own power and breaking free from the grip of large corporations. The Scythe Kaivi, in this sense, represents more than just an invention. It embodies a vision for a fairer, more sustainable future. 
It is a beacon of hope, a testament to the power of human ingenuity to overcome seemingly insurmountable challenges and chart a new course for humanity. Section 6 Challenging the Giants, Saith Kaivi and the Fossil Fuel Industry The potential impact of the Saith Kaivi on the oil and gas industry cannot be overstated. For over a century, this industry has held a tight grip on global power, dictating energy policies, shaping economies and influencing geopolitical landscapes. The prospect of a technology that could render fossil fuels obsolete poses an existential threat to this deeply entrenched system. Imagine a world where the demand for oil plummets, where sprawling refineries fall silent, and where the petrodollars that fuel economies around the world dry up. The ramifications are far-reaching and complex. Economic turmoil, geopolitical instability, and fierce resistance from those who stand to lose the most are all but guaranteed. The transition to a post-fossil fuel world will be fraught with challenges, but the Saith Kaivi could be the catalyst that finally tips the scales in favour of a cleaner, more sustainable future. The question is, will the world embrace this change, or will the giants of the fossil fuel industry succeed in suppressing this potential revolution? Section 7. A New Grid Energy Independence with Saith Kaivi the Sayeth Kaivi's impact extends far beyond the realm of transportation. Its self-charging technology has the potential to revolutionize the way we power our homes, businesses and communities. Imagine a world where reliance on centralized power grids becomes a thing of the past. With Sayeth Kaivi's technology, individuals could generate their own clean and sustainable energy, freeing themselves from the constraints of monthly bills and dependence on large corporations. This newfound energy independence could be particularly transformative for developing nations and remote communities that lack access to reliable electricity. The Saith Kaivi could empower these communities to build their own energy infrastructure, fueling economic growth and improving living standards. Hospitals could function without interruption. Schools could connect to the internet and businesses could thrive, all without relying on expensive and often unreliable grid connections. The Saith Kaivi represents a paradigm shift in power generation and distribution, one that could democratize access to energy and create a more equitable and sustainable world. Section 8. Shifting Sands. Global Power Dynamics in a Post-Saith Kaivi World. The geopolitical implications of the Saith Kaivi are profound. The current global order is built on a foundation of energy dependence, with nations vying for control of scarce resources and strategic shipping lanes. The widespread adoption of Scythe Kaivi's technology could disrupt this delicate balance of power, shifting influence away from traditional energy superpowers and towards nations that embrace this new energy paradigm. Developing nations rich in renewable resources but lacking the infrastructure to exploit them could emerge as major players on the global stage. Africa, in particular, with its abundant solar and wind potential, could become a powerhouse of clean energy, attracting investment, driving innovation and reshaping global trade routes. The Scythe Kaivi has the potential to level the playing field, empowering nations that have long been marginalized and creating a more multipolar world order. The transition will not be without its challenges, as existing power structures resist this inevitable shift. However, the allure of a cleaner, more sustainable future, coupled with the economic and geopolitical advantages offered by Sayeth Kaivi's technology, may prove to be too powerful to ignore. Section 9. Join the Revolution, Unleashing the Power of Truth The story of Maxwell Chikambutso and his groundbreaking invention, the Sayeth Kaivi, is a story of hope, resilience and the relentless pursuit of a better future. It is a story that challenges us to question the narratives we are fed by powerful interests, to look beyond the limitations of conventional thinking, and to embrace the transformative potential of true innovation. The Saith Kaivi is more than just a technological marvel. It represents a paradigm shift in our relationship with energy, the environment, and each other. It is a beacon of hope in a world grappling with climate change, energy poverty, and geopolitical instability. But the path to a Scythe Kaivi powered future is not without its obstacles. Powerful forces will undoubtedly attempt to discredit, suppress or even steal this revolutionary technology, just as they have done countless times throughout history. That is why 
It is more important than ever to raise awareness, to share this story far and wide, and to stand in solidarity with those who dare to challenge the status quo. Follow the updates, engage in the conversation, and join the movement for a cleaner, more equitable, and sustainable future. Subscribe now to my channel so you don't miss out on updates about this life-changing events that is about to take the world by storm. Give this video a life by liking it and sharing it. If this is the part you can play to secure the future of mankind, the world will be a better place because of that single gesture of your kindness. As always, I am Dr. Cool. See you in my next video. Don't forget to leave a comment. The time for change is now. Hash free energy revolution. Hash Scythe 2025. Hash Maxwell Chikumbutso.